The Colorado River now has a promising future thanks to snowfall, which has stocked the mountains with water that should comfortably support nearly 40 million people for another year. And although if we are all aware that it is temporary, just like the springtime weather forecast, it is nevertheless a pleasant place to be after a couple of tense years spent on the edge. The Colorado Mountain Snowpack has increased the average amount of snow water equivalent held there to 158%. That is an 8% increase in just one week. April will soon be here, and the prognosis for this week's end only calls for a little snow. Yet, the accumulations are astounding, reaching record highs from four years ago that were then followed by three years in a row with a percentage below 100%, including the pitiful 83.9% of last year. Don't anticipate Lake Mead to fill up faster because of the deep snow, if that's what you're expecting. Water officials have already planned their strategy for the upcoming few months, filling reservoirs upstream of Lake Mead in an effort, some have called it a desperate effort, to maintain normal during the mega drought. According to climatologists who have been keeping an eye on the upper Colorado River Basin during the mega drought that started 23 years ago, water flow has fallen by 20% during the past 20 years. Water managers will fill as many reservoirs as they can and retain as much water in Lake Powell as they can at the expense of Lake Mead unless there is a significant change.